What's up everybody and welcome back to the SAT Math Perfect 800 Tips Series. This is tip number five. Tip number five is something that I really like to do and I've gotten into a great habit of doing it as regularly as possible and that is to check every answer immediately. So of course, you're told if you have extra time to go back and check your work and plug in and all that stuff, but what I'm advocating for is to check immediately. So let's go through an example to show you what I mean. So we've got this question here, number 15, which of the following equations relates Y to X for the values in the table above. So a standard way that I might solve a question like this is to put it into slope intercept form by first calculating the slope using two coordinates. So check it out. I'm gonna take the difference of the Y's, 11 fourths minus 25 fourths over one minus two, right? So on top, we're gonna have negative 14 fourths over negative one. That's gonna just be positive 14 fourths, which is gonna reduce to seven halves. So I know my slope is seven over two. The only answer with seven over two as a slope is D. Now, by the way, I should mention that the exponential options are out because every single time the slope that I just calculated is consistent. It goes up by 14 fourths, 14 fourths, 14 fourths, 14 fourths, which is again, seven halves. So now I've got my answer, I can move on, I'm good. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make sure right away and it only takes five or 10 seconds. So really quickly, I'm gonna plug one in to this answer. And again, just to make it a little bit easier, I'm gonna rewrite the equation as 14 fourths times x minus 3 fourths, just so I can do the calculations a little more quickly. So as I plug in one, I've got 14 fourths minus 3 fourths, which is 11 fourths. And that is, of course, what we get here. I'm going to plug in two and I get 28 fourths minus three, which is 25 fourths. Boom. Plug in three. 42 minus three is 39. Plug in four. That's 56 minus three is 53. And then five is 70 minus three is 67. So you can see super quickly, I've assessed the situation. I've plugged everything in. I've made sure that I'm good to go. I have no stress. Boom. Done. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, make sure to come back to check out tip number six. Thank you guys so much for joining. I wish you all the best of luck on your SAT and I will see you in the next video. Take it easy.